Okay, so to refresh, we have seven Unity projects open, and I'm going to run Coplay, a task inside Coplay, inside Unity for each of them using the Coplay MCP. And uh, for each of those tasks, we attach this image, which is the UI that I wanted to recreate, this one. And I've got some instructions here on what it should and shouldn't do for UI. Uh, but the one thing I want to change between all seven projects is I'm going to uh, alternate the model that we use. So from GPT 4.1 to like Gemini to Claude uh, to the new Kimi. And yeah, basically I want to see if we run them all and it generates the UI, which model does the best. So let's uh, see if this works. Fingers crossed. Okay, so should list all of our projects that's open cool and now set the first project then create the task cool and here we can see this one is starting it's got the image attached so this will run for like the next 10 minutes or so and let's go back to this mcp okay here created the next one in test four so this one started and this is using o3 I'll just actually wait here. I think Claude will recline. Yeah, here we go. So this is now test three project, same prompt, Gemini 2.5. And yeah, that'll just keep running uh, to get through all seven. Let me go back to Klein here. Oh, now it's test one, same prompt. <laughs> and so it's just running through each of these and making tasks, um, saving us some benchmarking time. Let me pause here and I'll uh, update the status and they've all started up. Okay, so they've all started up and you can see them busy generating the components that they're going to use for the UI. So I'll just flip through a few of them. These are all the different models, like 2.5 is doing that. 3.7 is doing this. And what we have here, Claude 4 is doing this. And you can see here in the... Uh, Klein MCP tool that it's created for each of these projects using each of those models and we're just going to wait for that for the next 10 to 15 minutes. Um, cool, thank you.